power outages this morning at exactly the wrong time for people who are trying to stay warm. Encore says there are 5,200 customers without power right now, and people really being encouraged to conserve electricity. We just want to avoid any possible brownouts. Jenny and Chando is live with the details. Jenny. Yeah, so the potential problem is really simple. It's incredibly cold today. Everyone's going to get up, turn up the heat, and then that could put us in a situation, uh, you know, where we're really stressing the system. And so that's what officials are warning about. Just that we, we don't want to stress the system too hard because we don't want to have any problems moving forward. Now, this is not to the level we were at in 2014, which was where we were officially under a power conservation alert and facing potential power outages. But it's just a heads up that if we all don't help out, the power system will be stressed. ERCOT is the Electric Reliability Council of Texas. It's a nonprofit that manages the flow of electric power to our state. ERCOT representatives say that they are going to be monitoring this, especially during the peak hour, which is happening right now. They say between 7 and 8 this morning is going to be the peak today, most likely. So to help conserve energy, ERCOT says that we need to keep our thermostats as low as possible, preferably no higher than 68 degrees. They also say to unplug lights and appliances that we don't need today. Also, between 6 and 10 this morning and 6 and 10 tonight, which are typically the peak energy hours throughout the day in the winter, avoid running your washer, dryer, and electric ovens. Also, to keep from losing heat through the windows, go ahead and open your shades during the day. Now it's starting to get light out. Let the heat come in and then close them at night. So 30 minutes ago, we showed you a fresh bottle of water. We were doing a little experiment to see if it would freeze in that short amount of time. And yes, it is starting to. So you can kind of hear the, the crunch in there. There's still it's like the perfect ice water at this point in time if we're going to be positive. So we'll uh, we'll keep the water out here because you know I'm staying out here to tell you it's cold for the next uh, hour and a half or so reporting live in Plano Jenny and Chondo for good day yeah 15 degrees at the airport right now right. but I mean when you look at some of the surround like Denton for example was four degrees Jenny's mom frequently watches online and she's saying honey just go go warm up for a little bit they don't have to stand out there the whole time well you hop in and out of the of the, the live <laughs> truck that's so. there you know what i had a photo i had a, a photographer one time when i was in boston and he would make it 78 degrees and he'd play hawaiian music on days like today <laughs> i always thought that was so sweet <laughs> he would make you get in and make you feel like you were somewhere else just for a little bit because it's right. awfully cold out there serve up a mai tai <laughs> well we didn't, we didn't go that probably far, not right? while you're on the job